This is the Pal Talk News Network. The views expressed are solely those of the speaker and not necessarily those of PalTalk.com, AVM Software, or its advertisers. News Talk is online. News Talk Online is a production of PalTalk.com, the largest multimedia interactive program on the Internet with more than 4 million unique users on demand on iTunes and on YouTube and on my blog, GaryBombGarten.com, where you are encouraged to post your comments, whether you agree with yours truly or not, no retribution. And thanks to our good friends at CRN Digital Talk Radio, we're syndicated to an additional 12 million households. I am your host, Gary Baumgarten. I welcome you to the show. I recommend very highly that you check uh, several times a day to our website, paltalknewsnetwork.com. You find very interesting stories, some of which you may or may not hear, see, or read in the mainstream media. Uh, there's a story, our lead story right now, by our own Alan Jacy about a uh, special election, primary election, being held right now in Massachusetts to fill the uh, seat of uh, Teddy Kennedy, the U.S. Senator who died from a brain tumor. We're going to have uh, Alan join us in just a minute to talk about that. A lot about uh, climate and climate gate and whether or not uh, they're lying about uh, where uh, we really stand with regard to the climate. There's a great view from the radical middle by Robert Garcia, who is quickly becoming our, our most popular contributor on the PalTalkNewsNetwork.com site. In a minute, we're going to talk about the independent review of the FBI in the lead-up to the Fort Hood shooting being ordered, uh, concerns about the war in Afghanistan and whether our government is just naive or misleading us about it. Uh, you know, the president said uh, 18 months and We'll start withdrawing those 30,000 troops. And then over the weekend, the Secretary of State and the Secretary of Defense went on the talk show circuit and said, well, maybe two to four years. Well, uh, President Karzai today in Afghanistan said, we won't be ready to take over security for our country in guess how many years, Boaz Frankel? I believe uh, 15. 15. 15 years. 15 years, what do you get? A decade and a half older and deeper in debt. Flight delays have increased in the United States. Well, I, I posted that story, but it's probably no news to any of you. Uh, Amnesty International today uh, went on record against the... Uh, crackdown by the Iranian government on the demonstrators once again. The good news is that they're out in force once again today. No, not as many images are uh, coming through as before. That's because they've shut down cellular phone towers and have uh, cut off internet access. So it's trickling through the images. But rest assured, our people there are telling us that there are as many or more people on the streets and it's not just in Tehran, it is spread throughout the nation in opposition to this repressive regime and in support of human rights. Um, I hope I don't get in trouble for doing this, but I was told today that there's going to be a massive giveaway tomorrow at 8 o'clock New York time on uh, the Make It Pro show, M-A-K-E-I-T-P-R-O show. Uh, with uh, Lauren Perkins as my guest, the uh, professional skateboarder. And we're not supposed to announce it until the show tomorrow. Uh, but I figured, you know what, this is my audience, News Talk Online on the Pal Talk News Network. So I'm going to tell you what they're going to start doing tomorrow. And I sus I'm told that if you register now, even though it, the, the contest doesn't start officially until tomorrow, and this isn't even a contest. The first 30 people to leave Lauren Perkins a fun message tomorrow night. 
they say. But I'm whispering in your ears right now. God, I hope they're not listening to Make It Pro people. I'm going to be in trouble. On her wall at Make It Pro, we'll get a free Pal Talk premium upgrade. But you have to leave her a fun message. Okay? It's free to do it. They're going to have more prizes tomorrow night as well. All you have to do is go to makeitpro.com, M-A-K-E-I-T-P-R-O.com, slash profiles, slash Lauren, L-A-U-R-E-N, dash Perkins. Leave a fun message, and, you can, and, you, and the first 30 to uh, do so will get a free Pell Talk premium upgrade. Now, if we don't get a phone call, between now and the bottom of the hour, I'll re-announce that. If uh, we do get a phone call, Boaz, you have to edit that out of the archive of this show so I don't get in trouble. <laughs> right, but what Anyways, do we do about all the witnesses in the room here that heard you? Listen, they can listen disappear. my people, Boaz, know that what happens on the Pal Talk News Network, on News Talk Online, stays on the Pal Talk News Network, on News Talk Online. For goodness sakes. Didn't you know that? Special election, pr primary election going on today in Massachusetts to fill Teddy Kennedy's shoes. Uh, Alan Jacy, bring us up to date. Please, Alan. Alan's too bad, busy, uh, probably PMing somebody on the side. Boaz, I want you to play my favorite video of the day. Guys, oh, there he is. Hello, Alan. Uh, you back from your nappy pool? Hey. Oh, it was quite a good one. Yeah, hi, Gary. Hello, yeah. everybody. Yeah, I'm sorry, a little technical glitch. Yeah, today in the Bay State, uh, there is the special uh, primary to... Uh, select both the Democrat and Republican candidates that will uh, meet uh, next month, January 19th, to be uh, exact. Um, and uh, there are four Democrats and two Republicans. Again, it's a special election that will uh, be for Ted Kennedy's uh, Senate seat. The uh, liberal lion of the Senate passed away um, earlier, uh, in, well, in, in, towards the end of the summer. And uh, the seat is currently being... Uh, held by a, a longtime ally, who was appoint, uh, Paul Kirk, who was appointed to fill the seat um, by the Massachusetts governor, Deval Patrick. Um, the, the leading uh, candidate right now on the Democratic side is the state attorney general, Martha Coakley. Um, she's also probably the, the high, highest profile name um, of, of all the uh, candidates that are out there. But, but uh, Michael Capuano, who is a 